Hello, good morning good. and welcome. Good morning. Where are we, Mazzy? Stun and Barnes. We're back at Stun and Barnes. We certainly are. One of our favourite places in the world. Yes. We're here for a massive event this weekend. The big weekend. What's it called? The big weekend. The big weekend. They couldn't yeah. call it anything else. It's not a small <laughs> weekend. It's a big weekend and it's this weekend. Yes. So, uh, get yourselves here, guys. Um, lots of camping pitches available. I yes. can't remember. I think it's £28 a night for the camping field. So if you've got a motorhome, you've got a camper van, get yourselves here and stay for the weekend and have lots of fun with us because we're going to. We certainly are. And also you can hire uh, static caravans for the weekend as well. Can so, you? Yeah. Are you sure? Oh, unless if they're booked, I don't know. I don't know. Don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Um, but on top of that, anyone who hasn't got a stat uh, motorhome or camper van, just come in your car. Well, just come for the day. Come visit. It's free. It's totally free. free. This weekend is going to be brilliant. Dan's going to run through the lineup at this weekend soon, aren't you? Yes, we're going to be going into a lot of details. Um, yeah, completely free. And the whole idea of the weekend is to show you what is going to be happening all through the year here at Stone and Barnes. Yeah. There's a different thing going on every weekend all year. That's amazing. <laughs> amazing things like Comic Con, uh, bus festivals, uh, car festivals, motorbikes. Country weekends, uh, loads of music. Vikings, everything you can possibly everything. think of. Model railway weekend. So we're going to be going into all that. Yeah. <laughs> Let alone all this that's on your doorstep. <laughs> Isn't it? I don't know if you were, uh, I don't know if you saw his videos here last year. Yeah, um, if not, go back and watch them. Yeah. I'm going to uh, take a walk around today and just show, just give you a refresh, let you know what's here, what's changed, yes. and uh, yeah, give you a reason to come this weekend. Should we start at the Owl Sanctuary? No. No? Where do you want to start? Uh, I want to go to office and speak to Nick first. Let's go see Nick. <laughs> He's the sales manager um, who's. Uh, looking after us whilst we're here yeah mm -hmm. but yeah we're going to take you around as i say show you what's changed in the last year it is quiet at the moment it's 10 o'clock in the morning so everything's yeah. just opening yeah. <laughs> but it's going to be massive this weekend it really uh, is wait, how long does the weekend run is it friday till sunday friday when night it? starts about 6 p.m i think with music in the bar we'll yeah. run into it all later but right. saturday sunday it's all kicking off all kicking off so let's start with the big big weekend coming up just seen a sign for it here um so this is going to give you a quick idea three days free entertainment See, honestly the music is incredible i've got a separate leaflet for that i'll go into that in a bit um but live events showcase so it's showing you a bit of everything which is going to be going on throughout the year there's an event pretty much every weekend. We're gonna make a video tomorrow, I think, just going through all them weekends, telling you what's going on. So, this weekend, if you want to get yourself here, which you should, they're gonna be showcasing everything going on through the year. So you've got classic cars, motorcycles, tractors, trucks, steam engines, Land Rovers, scooters, vintage buses, living history, Vikings, Saxons, Knights, English and American Civil War, plus have a go, archery, axe throwing, I don't think I'll be allowed, uh, Vader's Raiders, Comic Con, I've actually got a Comic Con going on here this year, which I'd love to get to, Disney Princesses and his own mascot, Barney, all going on this weekend. So on top of that, Let's just show them this. There's, there's honestly, there's things all over, posters yeah. everywhere telling you what's going on. It's all happening. <laughs> this is the place to be. <laughs> so, uh, this just gives you an overview. So, bring your own caravan, motorhome, or tent. Uh, there is luxury bell tent or fully furnished static holiday co homes. Uh, facilities: you've got toilets, showers, laundry, washing up area. Uh, woodland walks, village stores, lots of them, restaurant, lots to do, children's attractions, pottery painting, shopping, owl sanctuary, golf centre, fishing lakes, family events, blah de blah de blah, it goes on and on and on and, and on. And to book if you, want to, if you want to call them or go to the website. Go to the website. If you do want to come, 
um, especially for the big week, well, whenever. Yeah. Uh, I think it's on pitch up now. So I'll just yeah. go and pitch up and you can book it. I think it's £28 a night, but don't hold me to that. I'm right. not sure. Just show them where it is as well, because I don't think you've told them exactly where it is. Yes, it's <laughs> not far from Ipswich, I don't think. It's in Suffolk. Past um, market. There's your address. All you have to do is put Stone and Barnes Park into Google and it'll show you exactly where we are. Get yourselves here. Right, we're going to take you down towards the campsite. Just have a quick look there. Yeah. <laughs> um, and on the way, I think we'll stop off at the golf place. We're going to be playing golf this week, aren't we? Absolutely. Love golf. What, normal golf or foot golf? Well, I can't swing a club, can I? Because of my arm. So it'll be foot golf. Foot golf. I can do yeah. crazy golf. Oh, yeah. they got crazy, crazy golf. Crazy golf and yeah. foot golf. <laughs> Let's go take a look. Also going on this weekend, and they do it quite a lot. I don't know if it's every weekend, not sure. Uh, car boot sale on a Sunday. Oh yeah, that's this weekend. I imagine that's going to be a big one. Yeah, we, we went to it last time, people. didn't we? Yeah. We didn't film it, I don't think, but uh, yeah, we had a good time there. So we're coming to the golf park. Stone and Barnes Golf Park. Now the thing about this, Stone and Barnes is made up of a lot of uh chair not chair. what am i trying to think of Different independent b businesses, businesses. Yeah. so they like rent the place yeah um and there's some strange connections you'll have a husband running a business on one side and his wife will have a completely different business yeah. on the other side uh, this is the golf park and the the owner of this also sells spas here is it spas yeah like the big, big baths Balls. The big bath things which we can't afford. <laughs> Never been in one, have you? No. No. So we're going to have a quick look at the golf park. So I saw on a leaflet this morning, it said disc golf. Mm. Now I'm wondering if it was just like discovery golf, maybe the adventure golf. Apparently not. I it, got it right though, I did yeah. guess right. It's like frisbee golf, you know where yes. you throw a frisbee into one of them chain nets. So that's going to be coming out in 2024. Next year. Yeah. It's going to be on, um, the, on basically on here, which is the yeah. new foot, foot golf, golf course. Different to the one we went on last yeah, year. Yeah, if you all remember, we had to go a game of foot golf, but it I was won. on the older field, wasn't it? Yeah, and I won. <laughs> it's yeah. still over there, but uh, yeah. we'll, we'll go on to that in a minute. So we are going to be playing this while we're here. Yes. Yes, absolutely. So this is Smuggler's Bay Adventure Golf Entrance. We didn't actually come in last time, did we, to have a little look? No, we didn't actually, but it is good, isn't it? Do like a bit of crazy golf. I adore, <laughs> it's my favourite spot. You could do it with your bad arm. Oh, I can do this. Golf. I can do this, I just yeah. can't do proper swinging golf. Yeah. Yeah, very well maintained, pirate theme. It's very windy today, I'm hoping there's uh, microphones holding up okay. <laughs> but yeah, so you've got ships and pirates and barrels and little water features going all the way around. X, ooh, massive water feature thing up there. Okay, so we're gonna give this a good go. Um, I'll just hand this to Mazzy for a second because I think I've got a leaflet on this in here. I've just picked up. Now the place is so good that actually last time we came to Son and Barnes, my sister actually booked up a holiday here and her and my little nephew played crazy golf and they absolutely loved it and oh, enjoyed yeah. it. So yeah, they spent here. a week here. Yeah, they really enjoyed it. Uh, so yeah, I just picked this leaflet up. Um, prices so adults seven pounds juniors five pound family rate 19 pounds which is two adults and two juniors yep. open every day and with the leaflet if you wander around you'll find the leaflet five pound off five pound off the family rate that's with this good leaflet. so that would make that 14 quid for two yeah. adults and two kids yeah that's that's good i don't know how many yeah. holes there is but it looks big yeah it does look big it goes a bit quite a bit further actually <laughs> What the last hole is. 18, there is 18, 18 hole. hole. And this is exciting actually. I'll tell you when you get round here. 
Yep, I'm just looking at the snake down there. I was wondering if it was real. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> What's the exciting bit, honey? Well, you have to come in. Well, they do anyway. Right, I did hear a rumour in the bar yesterday that they're actually doing a bit of a collab with the bar restaurant thing. Um, this is the 18th hall. Now, I remember similar halls as a kid, and if you won on this one, you got a free round of golf. And this is a similar thing, I'm guessing if you get your hole in one in this, you could win a prize in the future. And I think what they're trying to do is maybe, I, don't, I shouldn't really say anything because I might have it completely wrong. <laughs> I think you might get like. Um, you want to say it, but you can't confirm it totally. I don't know. A collab with the restaurant, so you might get some maybe free food or something. Or I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Or that might be to come. A discount off a meal. I don't know. Well, it's not on the leaflet at the moment, no. so. It's just what they're talking yeah. about. I might be giving insider information yeah. I shouldn't be doing. Top secret. All right, let's go and check out football. Uh, football. Football. Foot <laughs> on top of that, in, well, we'll show you that. We did show you last time, but we'll show you what's inside as well. But this is the new foot golf course, which is opening at Easter. But they are actually opening it up this weekend for just like a... That's going to be good. Showcase it. Oh, Give brilliant. people an idea yeah. what it's going to be like. Yeah. Um, we're actually going to have a go at this. We are going to have a go at yeah, this. So and I am going to win at this. <laughs> Again, that looks really big. So I'm not sure how many holes that is, but I can count loads of flags. I'm preferring it to where the last course was, or still is, should I say. Yeah. Because it's more... It is just foot golf. The other one was mixed in with the actual golf. But, but they did well to combine it for the meantime until they got yeah, this yeah, set yeah, up, yeah. didn't yeah. they? So there you go, there's your little... So if you want to know what foot golf is... Yeah. It is so fun. I wouldn't want to play it in this wind though. <laughs> because I could not play last time because it was windy. I was really bad at it. And if this doesn't take your fancy, then you've got golf. <laughs> You've got normal golf. You've got normal golf. Or you've got um, the big well, screen inside we're going to go inside. Well, haven't you? Yeah. We did see someone coming out of his car with some golf clubs, so it's seen as a proper golfy place yeah. as well. So let's just check out this, uh, what is it, like a virtual uh, golf? Eight price, five quid. What's that for? Foot oh, the foot golf. And you get to choose your Five pound for your foot, ball. foot golf. Foot go Seems strange saying foot golf. <laughs> <laughs> and then yeah you can hire this out as well for like uh, well corporate events and things but I'm just thinking stag do's that's all I can think of when I come in here yeah this is brilliant you know if the weather's a little on the cold side or you, you know just coming in this is brilliant <laughs> yeah. you can pick your course they have all the big famous courses around the world it is just like you pick proper golf clubs up. You we whack had the a balls. Go at this, didn't we? The last time we, we did. Were here. We weren't very good at it. No, but and, as I and say, there's two as well, so you're not. There is two. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I did break my arm last year, so I can't swing a club anymore. <laughs> just a little bit of, just a little bit of um, crazy golf, and that should crazy be golf will do me. Yeah. But yeah. But there is normal golf as well, isn't there? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So I'm really looking forward to having a go at the golf, but that's for another day. Yeah. Just checking this out here. Um, ten pound a month, juniors, under 13s golf membership. So ten pound a month, the most cost-effective junior golf membership scheme in Suffolk. Play nine-hole uh, golf, basically. Free use of the Barnes Stone and Barnes golf course. Free use of. Finn Valley Nine Hole Course, fifty percent off Smugglers Bay's Adventure Golf, twenty percent off Foot Golf. That's really That's good. That's really good for ten pound a month. Because I'll tell you what, when I was twelve, for example, that is the kind of thing I'd do every day, summer holidays yeah. and stuff. <laughs> and let's be real, golf, proper golf memberships ain't cheap. So you know, no. you kid, ten quid a month. That's really good. Right, where's the campsite? It's such a big place, it we keep is. getting lost. We it's need to... all the way back there. Right, we need to get to the campsite. A quick look over there, Mazza. Quick look. So this is your proper golf and your current foot golf. 
Uh, you can see the guys playing there, proper golf. I think it's nine holes. Very nice. And then, yeah, we're just taking a bit of a shortcut here through to the campsite. So, massive event on this weekend. And at the moment, not a single motorhome or caravan. Come on, guys, get yourselves here this weekend. Free entertainment. Pick any pitch you want. You've got your toilet facilities and everything in here got everything you need and it is just two minutes around the corner to all the activities we stayed on this pitch last time and had a really good time we loved it here so we're not going to go into too much detail uh today we're just trying to show yes. you a little bit of everything yeah um so you've got your campsite it looks like they do storage as well i don't yeah. know you'd have to ask about that yeah yeah they do i remember do that yeah so you can pay and have your caravan not stored here lack of, um, spaces here no hundreds get yourself here this yeah. weekend come and join us you've got your tp tents on the other side as well you've got tp tents you've got the bell tents bell tents that's what i meant yeah <laughs> yeah i don't know if they're up at the moment i'm not sure i'll be honest with you um you have got a it's like a train or something here which the kids can actually go on i think yeah the owner is a bit of a train enthusiast and he likes to see the kids enjoying themselves on the trains yeah <laughs> um you've also got here we're going to be showing you everything in detail while we're here but we're not going to be walking around it all today so uh stone and bounds lakeside lodges look at that you can buy these how would you like to live well stay in one of them for the season that would be nice which you can come here and do fishing as well also can't you? fishing they have fishing yeah. events there is a fishing weekend coming up competition and everything yeah yeah um Right, let's get back around there and show you some of the shops and things. Yes. What, what's on site. Got an old classic fire engine there. So we're just walking up here because this is where the show ground is. This is where all the events are going to be kicking off this weekend. I just can't imagine what it's going to be like because they, yeah. haven't, they haven't started setting up yet. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to be bedlam in here tomorrow, I should imagine, getting it all ready. Still got a couple more days yet, haven't we? Yeah. So. <laughs> As I say, it starts Friday night in the bar Which and theatre yeah. <laughs> at 6pm but then all through Saturday and Sunday, all day, there's things going off in there and on the showground. But yeah, let's have a quick look at it. So this is your showground. When we were here last year, they did all the reenactments within this bit and you had stalls all the way around and the villages of all the Vikings or whatever they were over yeah. there. Really cool. Lots of catering fans for food and stuff as well. Yeah. Another bar actually over there, wasn't there last time? Uh, there's a wedding venue over there, I'm, I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm sure that was a bar. Oh yeah, they had pizzas and all sorts here, didn't they? Yeah. Um, so this weekend, there's a lot of music going on all the yes. time. So that looks like it's going to be the stage. Um, bands, uh, Saturday, Sunday, I believe there's bands on from like 11 in the morning until yeah. 6 at night, something like that. So you don't have to just think it's a nighttime occasion, this. this no, no, no. Day. Just bring your kids and come and enjoy yourself. Family orientated this is going to be, isn't it? Dogs welcome as well, so. I think it's... Uh, it's it's a mixture of music as well it's not just one kind it's all yeah. different music to suit everybody and i think yeah. the the bands change like every hour something like that every hour and a half because uh, so, although they have a music here they have a music over there and over there as well aren't yeah. they so it's not yeah. all just in one place either. so you've got music here in the showground you've got music in the bar itself and music in the theater and don't forget this is all free 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 oh wow can you do that any screechier? Hey! All right, calm down, calm down. <laughs> you, you know me, plenty of toilets, just need to let everybody know. Yep, she's been to four of them already. I actually have. And on that note, if you can hear a dog, get your pet groomed while you're here as well. Pet grooming. Now, somebody, when we came here last year, did come to the yeah. event and camped on the campsite where we were. Yeah. 
and they actually took the dog in there. And I think there was a few people that had done that that we met. Right. Yeah. They so. actually got the dog groomed but, in there, so. Or, hey, look, you can even bring your cat, your rabbit, or your guinea pig. Yeah, come and, <laughs> you know, bring your <laughs> guinea pig down to Stonham and get it uh, <laughs> groomed. <laughs> So yeah, this is where we came in last time. You had to have tickets, but it is free as this weekend. It's so free. But if you want to be buying tickets for any upcoming events, this is the place to come as well. Are this? I don't know if they're available, are they? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> We're jumping the gun there. We don't jumping know. Jumping the gun. Uh, you've actually got a tuning place here. You know the oh, yeah? TDI tuning box we have on our motorhome. A similar competitor Brilliant. type oh, thing that there. Is, oh. We'll have to go into that on another video, won't we? It's a very specialist thing is a tuning box, but yeah. we have a company here who do it. Oh, you can feed the ducks. Come and feed the There's ducks. There's no ducks. Yeah, well, you can... Oh, look at all the fish. Oh, wow. Is that showing up on camera? There is... Well, maybe this... A oh, hundred fish. fish food. A hundred fish in a little circle there. There you go. Bring your 20 peas for your kids. Fish... For fish. Feed the fish. <laughs> I thought it was ducks last year. I can't remember. Yeah, it's all fish food. Um, Maybe they've changed it to fish until the ducks come back. Maybe they've migrated for the year. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, probably. <clears throat> then you have got the Suffolk Owl Sanctuary, which we are going to be Absolutely. going in. Absolutely. We never had time last time. We didn't do it. This is amazing on its own, isn't it? It's it's a owl it's a sanctuary which I really like. You know, they're looking after rescued owls and yeah. things like that as well. Um, and they also have meerkats in here. Look at this, Mazzy. That's what I oh. want to go for. Oh, I tell you what we saw last time. The guy with the big eagle. Do you remember? We did in the he car park out, somewhere. He was yeah. training it in the car park. Yeah. So yeah, I think I read there's like 40 different types of owls or something in here. So I'm really looking forward to. It. Oh look, vulture. So yeah, looking forward to that. We'll definitely do that. Absolutely. As I say, we're trying not to show you too much today. We're just rushing round. We can only fit so much into a rushing round into Should a we video. Go back down up this way just to quickly show what's here for the kids. Quick, then. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, you. <laughs> you have a land train. Yes. Uh, which we never got on last time. No. There is what? a there is a mascot as well. I think he's called Barney, isn't it? Something like that. Oh, Come on. Is that him? Yeah. Uh, I'm get I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It's like a big teddy bear and he walks around. Yeah. So you've got Stun and Bounds teapot tea room. A little cafe at the back of there as well. Yeah. We'll That's go good. We're going to just quickly walk in there, Mazzy. Yeah. Um, and then you've got all this children's area. So you've got the Dodgems here, which were at the back last time we were here. And look. have got this on the right look, which is actually free for the kids when you're chilling out, having a cup of tea look. <laughs> what is it like a big bouncy yeah, like a big bouncy thing i got stuck on it last time if you remember <laughs> so you've loads of different kids games going on in the back lots of inflatables and things you've got to visualize everybody this is going to be open yeah everything's going yeah. to be open and buzzing yeah, yeah. it's it's like a mini fair for young yeah. kids yeah for young kids keep the kids happy right just going to quickly walk through here because we missed this last time we were cafe, here yeah. the cafe yeah, yeah. Hello. Hi guys. Hi. Good morning. Hi. So we're, we're just walking through today, don't worry. We'll be back. So this is where they do all the teapots, which we showed you last year, and they've got a commemorative one this year, Mazzy. I know. Where is it? Oh. No, that's the Queen. Gone. Where's Charles gone? It'll be here this afternoon. Oh. oh. We'll come back tomorrow. <laughs> Not here yet for the for King Charles. Uh, but in the back here, I didn't know this were here last time. Yes, tea yes, room. Cafe. No one told us there were a tea room. <laughs> but yeah, in the back here is actually a tea room. So we'll probably be coming in here for the odd tea and cake. We're a balcony, look. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> but yeah, really nice little area. We didn't know it were here. So we'll definitely be stopping off there. Yeah. Moving on. Oh, and you can get your kids though to come and do some pottery as well. You know, all like right. where they do all the painting and stuff. We'll be going into that at a later day. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. 
So whilst you're here, if anyone's interested in staying here or buying a static or a lodge, Come uh, check them out. speak Come to Nick the salesman. Yeah. But there's one here, you can just walk in and have a look. This is for sale. A seven £95,000. Oh. Oh. This is a different one from last time, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, I'm sure they keep changing them around. Very nice. All right, innit? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Loving it. Yeah, even if you just want to come for a wander, have a gander. You know what we're all like. Oh, there'll be a sales team in here, Mazzy, trying to sell these there this weekend. Will be. But if you want to buy one, come and buy one. There is actually a new uh, lake here as well, isn't there? Uh, I don't know if it will. Yeah, sort of, yeah. I don't yeah. think it was here last time we were Well, the lake was here, but I think they were still digging it out to oh, make I it see. big enough for certain things. Yeah. I think we're going to have to show that on a different video. Yeah. Because I'm not entirely sure where it is. I think it's down there. Uh, yeah, let's get to the shops. We're running out of time. This video is getting too long. It is. <laughs> too much to do, too much to see. So we're really going to whiz through all these shops now. You have got a sup den. Get on board so you can actually buy your sup boards here and all your gear. You know, they have got lakes, they're doing all this outdoor activities on the lakes. This is fantastic, you can buy hot drinks, sandwiches, you've got all your needs, you can buy your alcohol, tobaccos, all your daily everything in there. The village shop. The village shop, And yeah. they do get, they're getting a delivery today, I don't know if they've had it yet, but they get a delivery from the local butchers and stuff. Yeah, it's all proper, local produce, so to proper say. Proper yeah. meats and stuff. Yeah. We'll go into all the shops in detail on another floor, yeah. won't we? Yeah, we're already up to 25 minutes. Oh gosh, we better hurry up. So in here, you might remember they do some incredible lamps. Yes. Like I went in yesterday, I had a quick chat to him and I said he's a bit like Wallace and Gromit <laughs> to, to come up with these ideas. <laughs> uh, the things he's turned into lamps is incredible. Like, look at this. Is that off a boat or oh, something? That's a big fantastic. floodlight? You'd love that, wouldn't you, in yeah. your house? Anyway, moving on, we ain't got time. Let's go down this way. Old sweet shop. Spent a fortune in there last time, didn't you, Mazzy? I did, yes! <laughs> and I sure will be this time again. It's got all your American things as well, look, your Reese bars and stuff. Little antique store there, you spent money in there. I bought there. something there last time, yeah, antique shop. There's quite a lot of antique shops here. There is, yeah. Some really good, unique things. You can, um, you've got hairdressers here, you can get your hair and nails done. You've got everything. Um, <laughs> crystal shop. Oh yes! Stone Rose new? Crystals. No, this were here last time. Oh, was it? Oh, I don't recall. I don't think we went inside it, but no, probably not. Yep, all your crystals. We will um, be going in there. Opposite, look, it's your doggy business. This is amazing. This shop. We went in here last time. The ladies in there are lovely. And the dog's business pet shop. You can buy everything and anything in there. For a dog. Yeah, for a dog. <laughs> yeah. Including well, weird food, you know, like rabbit ears and stuff or whatever they eat. Yeah. Uh, we'll be going good, in there. <laughs> it's all good quality stuff. We'll be going in there. We'll be again. going in there well, during the week. Yeah. Um, we walked past there earlier and the lady remembered us from last year. But if you ain't got time to buy dog food, have a spa. You can come and buy a spa. Hot tub. Hot tub. That's the word we're looking for. <laughs> hot tub. That's hot cool. tub. We'll be taking you in here. They've got dozens of hot tubs and it goes on forever. Jacuzzis and all sorts. I don't know. <laughs> but I wanted to quickly show. Oh no, it's not there. No, is it up here? One of these is incredible, guys. No, can't find it. I'll have to show you it on a different video. It's like a swimming machine, a wave machine, which you swim into, but you don't move because the waves keep pushing you back. Just for another day. Um, flowers and gifts for all occasions. Yeah, got a little dance shop there for all that, your little girls' dresses and stuff. I love this. I think this is just for show because is it the owner or something he likes it's the owner yeah he collects all stuff, vintage stuff yeah he's got a bit of a museum which we'll be getting to um if suffolk get, bridal yeah, outlet if you're getting married soon <laughs> yeah well we got engaged two weeks ago i think need a bit longer <laughs> a bit longer um sheds look. look at this for a garden cabin look, in the bottom of your garden <gasps> That's mm. nice. So this is a garden centre in here, a, yes. an entire garden centre. Yep. 
just goes on and on and on. It's massive, this place. I'm just keeping the camera rolling now because... Uh, 50% off everything. Now that's the reason to come this weekend, isn't it? 50% off everything? That's all right, isn't it? There you go, yeah. So, moving up here, you have got the tumble down soft plate barn. Yep, your kids can go in and play there. Which I do believe that's getting taken over sometime soon though, isn't it? Well, this is Aspol Antiques. Um, we showed you a lot in there last time. Yeah. I believe they're expanding and they've got this now. Yeah. So the, this is going to be part of it in the future. I don't even know if we should be saying all this. I know, we're keeping top secret. You know, we've so been right. told things and it <laughs> might not be things which the public are meant to know yet. Oh, there is a reclamation yard here as well. I don't think yes. we get to show that today. Uh, uh, unless we're walking past it. Cafe 24, they've actually changed their name since we've last been They there. have. So that's a nice little restaurant yes. in there. I had a full English and sat there last time. Which we sure we oh apparently they do roast dinners, which I didn't know. Roast dinners on a Sunday, yeah. So that's and don't forget this Sunday you've got a massive car boot sale as well. Mm. What else? Uh back round this way. <laughs> yeah. We have a bookshop. So all your old vintage books in there as well, better some collectibles. The vintage cellar. Oh, this is brilliant. This shop's brilliant, but we'll go into more of this. Oh no, it's that one I'm thinking of, isn't it? Well, this you is the one I love. Fun. Yeah. They sell things like uh, football programs, uh, matchboxes, everything what I used to collect as a kid is Big in there. Big boys toys. And uh, coins yeah. and everything in there. This one here is all full of like crafts and stuff. It's brilliant. Yes. Should we take them in for a sneak peek? Just a quick, sneak just to give them an idea of what it's about. So this is called the attic, is it? Yeah. The attic. So the idea is... Hello. Hello. We're not going to go into detail now, but basically this is all like different people who make things and they just hire a shelf and sell their products and it's all different, handmade, locally made. Most of it's in Suffolk. Absolutely brilliant. So supporting all the local businesses in Suffolk, I really like this. Yeah. Because we have been to like antique markets and things in the past. Just cool my front music, Mazzy. So if you're interested also in renting a little shelf here, give them a call, see what mm, they say. Never know. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, we've been to like antiques places in the past and it's like a big warehouse or barn. Yeah. And they separate into cubicles and different for companies. For different sellers. For different sellers. So yeah. this is like a mini version of it, it's yeah. all under one little roof but it's good Brilliant. for crafters where you like you enjoy making something but not on a massive scale mm. you know you think just a little shelf like that if you can and it's all unique thing you know yeah all uniquely made thing i love it we're gonna have a proper look yeah, in this gonna, later in the week we're gonna come back a different day <laughs> yeah we must be up to 35 minutes on this video now ah, we're gonna, gonna, gonna rush around it. Moving on. And if that's not enough for you, you can buy anything and anything in this shop. Anything and everything. Anything and everything, that's the word. Now, we took a look in this <laughs> earlier and you yes. won't believe what we have found. They literally do sell anything and everything and something which we have to buy. And you're going to agree with us when we see it. Check out what they are selling in here. It is a light up Trolls. A Trolls light and it's only £3 battery operated or USB we're definitely taking one of them now before they sell out I'll tell you what Mazzy if it's fantastic we might buy them all brilliant that's gonna that's amazing isn't it let's go and pay for it the thought of finding that yay I've never seen one of them before thank you, thank you. have a nice day thank you, are you happy, I'm very happy. <laughs> and now now the one thing they're lacking here at the moment, but they are going to try and get two cash machines in here apparently. Oh yeah, that trying. would be handy, yeah. Um, but there is a post office where you can get money. Oh just yeah, just card in and here. Get some money. So because there's an event on this weekend and there's going to be like burger stalls and stuff, I should imagine, uh, I need to get some money. Yeah, and this shop actually in particular sells everything and anything as well. That is amazing. It's also a toy shop, because that used to yeah. be a toy shop next door. Um, but they've moved all the toys in here now. Yeah, so we will go into that one day. It's not just normal toys, you know, it's got like your proper 
Solar system, planetary orbits. I like the chocolate factory, look. I like the marble park out. You know, them barbarian things go around them. Yeah. It's right, full of things like we that. We ain't got time. Let's move time. on. I need to get some money out, though. And while Dan's at the post office, you can actually go across the road from there and go cruise and travel. You can book holidays, you can book cruises, you can go in and take your pick to where you'd like to go. And this is your beauty barn, you can go in there and get, I'm sure you can get your nails done, but you get your hair done. Again, that's your antique store and then your village store. Just on the corner you have a little boutique shop, really unusual stuff. But again, we're gonna go into that in a little bit more detail on another day. We'll take you inside. Yeah. So I've just got some uh, cash, some money back from the post office, but I just saw this birthday card and it is hilarious. Information, ignore your past, you can't change it. Ignore your present, I didn't buy you one. <laughs> Brilliant. So I don't know what Maz has just told you about this bit, but the, the hairdressers, women's hairdressers, um, I believe that is owned by the wife of the man who runs that one so it's a husband and wife and they're gonna have a barbers in there as well so in there you can get your holidays and some like old vintage clothes by the look of it That's brilliant um, we still haven't shown you at all but we've done our best so far haven't we have we been up here yes. yeah is there anything we've missed we need to get over there and show them the theater we need to try and get in the theatre and bar just to talk about this weekend. Yes. Don't forget, you've got to come this weekend. Yeah, don't forget, and it's free. It's free. free. And we're going to be there. <laughs> don't let that put you off, though. <laughs> um, you've got an artist there as well, local art. Information points. Uh, somewhere to get all your fishing gear, fishing tackle. Right, I'm lost now, Mazzy. Up into the theatre. Oh, it's this way. That's your holiday park, that direction. Yeah, that's where your static caravans and things are up there. So we'll just come into the bar. We're setting everything up for the weekend. <laughs> so exciting. Check this out. Oh, wow. They actually have proper darts here. Proper, proper darts. Um, I believe they're trying. Might not happen. Trying to get some famous dart players come in later in the year. It'll probably happen. <laughs> I know who it might be, but I'm not saying because I might. You've spoiled might, too many things today. I, I probably have. <laughs> so, can you just hold that? Yes. And I'll just show them this. So this is the mu music schedule for this weekend. So in the theatre, which is next door, I don't know if we can get through there. We might be able to. Danny might let us. Um, so in the bar, the bar is open till about 11 o'clock at night on Friday. Saturday from 11 in the morning, I think. Um, but you've got acoustics. And Saturday, Sunday, you've got all these playing, look. Billy Hunt, he's just releasing a song. Um, you've got, where's, where's the lady, Mazzy? Lauren Jennifer, she's just releasing a song as well. So some pretty big names here and a complete mixture of what's yeah, going on. Yeah, we're different, yeah. So you're going to have, like, acoustic sets, I think, in, in the bar. And bands on in there as well. So we're in the theatre now, uh, which is completely changed from when we were last year. It's more like a proper music event now. Look at the stage. All the guitars in the background. All the bands are going to be on this weekend. So I've just been counting. I think there's, there's even like a dance floor now, look. Yeah, all you ladies <laughs> get your dancing heels on. <laughs> Any handbags? <laughs> I've just been looking. I think I've counted nine <laughs> different acts are on on Saturday. Uh, wow. Ten different acts are on Sunday, including belly dancing. Ooh, <laughs> that'd be interesting. So it's a mixture of all different types of music, yeah. belly dancing, um, and comedy. Is that in here? Yeah. I'm I can't sure. remember his name. He had a strange name. Uh, Robin Dicker. Musical comedy. Musical comedy. So he plays you the guitar me, and does comedy songs. Yeah, you showed me a clip of that kind of thing yeah. this morning, didn't you? It was yeah. quite funny, yeah. So we're going to be coming in here and we'll text yeah. a few clips of the different apps what are going to be on as well. But we'd like you to join us. Yeah! Get yourself here. Come the big have weekend. A with us. <laughs> and a drink. <laughs> yeah, so the guy running the theatre actually has his own uh, music company. Yeah, what a lovely girl. Um, and as I said, two of, uh, Lauren, 
Lauren Jennifer and Billy Hunt and the Modern Classics are both releasing songs on his record label mm. in this next month. So, yeah, we'll be coming in here. They haven't got your drink, though, has he? Oh. No, we're going to have to be drinking something else in here. It's all the local beers. So, out to the... Take care! Yeah. <laughs> Take care, Daddy! <laughs> and out we go. There was a bit I couldn't find early, but I found it. Uh, interior bedrooms and bathroom, kitchen specialists. But this bit is the classic cars look. It's just like a tiny little museum. This is the owner's little collection. A couple of classic cars there. An old Vauxhall in there. That's a beauty. Don't know what that is. A Luton. Is there such a thing as a Vauxhall Luton? Because if there is, that's one. And then around here, look, you've got... What's this thing here? This wasn't here last time I was here. That's pretty cool. Look at that. And then you've got some old vans and things in there and some chopper, chopper bike. And over here you have got your uh, reclamation yard, which we will be having a great look around. I just wish I had a house, honestly. This is the kind of place I'm going to do all my housing. We both love these places, so mm, we what certainly do. It's going to look like this, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> That's our spell reclamations, if you're interested. Right, I think this is the last bit we've missed out, Mazzy. It sure is, yeah. <laughs> I do want to get in there tomorrow. I like that. If that's for sale, Mazzy, an open sign. You know, for in background when you're going live and stuff. Yeah. Quite like that. Uh, so these are going to be a lot of up-and-coming up new shops, aren't they? Yeah, there's I'm a few guessing. few new ones since last year. Another hair studio oh. there. Light by night. Don't oh, know what this candles. is. Oh, lovely. Candle shop, yeah. Well, let's carry on, Mazzy. Let's carry on. <laughs> You've just got six candles. <laughs> Oh, there's uh, oh, there's your holiday home. Holiday home. So if you're interested in any statics or lodges or anything, go there. Ask for Isn't Nick. Yeah. Nick will sort you out. Yeah. Um, telling the travel troll sent you for a hundred percent discount <laughs> for the next three minutes only. Right. <laughs> uh, this is all your cards. You know your game cards and things. Collectibles. Collectible cards. Kind of thing, yes. Um, so we have been down here now. Oh, personalised printing, oh. t-shirts and hoodies, mugs, coasters, that's interesting. And I do know there was another shop here, but I can't remember where it is. It's like all eco-friendly stuff, you know, you can buy all your little goods. I think it's this one. Oh, is it this one? Yeah, it is. Yeah, this is all eco-friendly. This is a new shop, I think. Yeah, this is new. So we'll be taking a look in there. You know, you can come in and buy your little portions you know when you buy it bring your own tops or however it works I'm not fabric really sure conditioner yeah things like that <laughs> okay that's good yeah like that and there is somewhere we we haven't even been around it all there is a little museum a bit as well where oh, you can see some yes. classic motorbikes and things it's all free again all free yeah somewhere around here yeah and the reclamation yard it's near there isn't it I don't know. I think it I is, know. yeah. It's finding everything in one day. Right. <laughs> Let's just sit down here and sum this up. The big weekend. So this has just been a summary of mm -hmm. everything. Small little bit of it. And we've probably missed a load out <laughs> yeah. as well. Well, we, I know we have. Um, but the big weekend starting Friday, tomorrow. Yep. Um, for three days, free entry. Stonham Barnes Park. I'm just looking yeah. at the leaflet here, reading a few bits off it. So you've got the Legend Sports Bar, um, live events showcase, live music, dance, comedy, ultimate free day out, 
Live events here, look, this is what I'm looking for. <laughs> I've told you earlier, but classic cars, motorcycles, tractors, trucks, steam engines, Land Rovers, scooters, vintage buses, living history, Vikings, Saxons, Knights, English and American Civil War. Um, it just goes on and on and on. And on. It's a massive list of everything. So don't miss out. Don't miss out. And if you can't come on the Friday or the Saturday, come on the Sunday. And if you can't come on the Sunday, come on the Saturday. <laughs> and if you can come all weekend, come all weekend. You've got statics you can hire or the campsite. I don't know if there's any statics. You keep saying that. There yeah, might they not are be. for hire, but whether there's any available, I don't know. You'll have to go on know, the website. But the campsite, yeah. definitely. So yeah. if Ooh. you've got a motorhome or a camper van, yeah. uh, you can get them on pitch up. Yeah. Or just follow the link in the description for Stone and Barnes itself. We'll put yeah. that down there so you can check that and out. And we're going to be here all weekend, so you're bound to bump into us. Oh, you'll definitely yeah. bump into <laughs> Mazzy. <laughs> Why? Why are you? Um, thank you for watching. <laughs> yes. So we're going to be doing quite a few videos here now of yes. all the all the events, all, all the, the weekend, exciting stuff, and going into more detail in some of the shops and businesses yeah. here. And we're going to be playing golf. Yes. And I'm going to win. And the Owl Sanctuary. We're gonna. We've got lots Owl to Sanctuary. do. We've got lots to do. Yes. Get yourself here this weekend, the big weekend. We'll see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you this weekend. Bye. You better come. <laughs>